be good. Uh. Guys, I don't know how I'm actually early today. I thought I was gonna be late because I took the time to edit a video. Um, I got the girls dressed, I got my makeup on. It literally takes me two seconds. Like I know everyone's like, how do you do your makeup? And Mom, my it just fall takes in me the ten bathroom. minutes. That's pretty, although I didn't contour yet. I, I thought this was in the bathroom. That's pretty, you can wear that. It's very Christmassy. So I'm just um, getting them ready. My house is in the, no, red is Christmassy, so is green. Um, got her lunch. It's white, Mom. <laughs> Reese's rolling around over there. Put this in her lunch, and we're good to go. Time to clean up. Like you'd think I had 10 children or something. Like what? Oh lordy. That's better and I vacuumed because there's always muck that gets dragged in here. I still have to fold that laundry over there um, and that's a slipper in Olivia's baby. But um, I gotta get her a pull up because I gotta change her butt. But um, I am so exhausted today. So I was up since, I've been up since 5.30. I didn't go to bed till like 10.30. Reese woke me twice. Olivia woke me once. And I've been up since 5.30. I literally feel like I'm dreaming. Like I'm like delirious today. <laughs> what are we doing right now? We're doing a marble run. Marble run! Do you love marble run? Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh goodness. So we're doing marble run. Um, we've already done Play-Doh. We've played with Play-Doh. And now we are doing, you can't see me. Now we are doing ugh, Marble Run. And I have so much I want to do today. Um, I want to wrap presents. Finish wrapping presents when the girls sleep. Make sugar cookies, make pizza dough, because we're having pizza for supper tonight. And like get the icing ready so we can do that when Blake gets home from school. Um, oh, it's starting to snow a little bit, Liv. What else would I want to do? It's okay, she's the neighbors. Is that it? Just like wrap? Wrap and cookies and make pizza dough and just like start my Christmas baking. I just want to start like doing the Christmas things because it's coming really fast and I want to just get it all done. So <laughs> that'll be fun. That's what I have to do today. Okay, you put the marbles in. My turn? Okay, mommy's gonna get I got the marbles between my legs. Hold up. Isn't that cool? That's my turn. Okay, so we're gonna start on our sugar cookies. Um, so they are just a super simple recipe. I'll put the link to them down below. You don't need to like um, chill them or anything. It's literally just butter, um, sugar, vanilla extract, almond extract, an egg, baking powder, salt, and flour. So I'm gonna make those and then that way we can decorate them. Like I'll make the icing when the kids are sleeping and then when Blake gets home, we can decorate them and it's like all done. So that's what we're gonna do now. We're gonna preheat the oven to 350 degrees. Mom is a literal saint. She stopped in so that I could get stuff from the store really quick to do my baking. So I got my molasses. Um, sorry, Reese's in my arm. She's trying to grab the camera. I got this um, cinnamon dolce coffee creamer because I'm so excited. This is way cheaper at Costco. I paid $8 at my grocery store and at Costco, one that's like a liter is um, I think 12 and this was eight. So got cornstarch, white chocolate chips, butter, icing sugar, a cake mix, and my mom brought me food coloring. So I'm super excited to bake. It's 11 o'clock now though. Um, little Miss Reese just woke up, did you? So I'm gonna try and nurse her, although lately she's not as interested in nursing as, unless it's like nighttime because she's trying to look at everything. She gets distracted. Um, so I might just do the sugar cookies really quick and then I'll try and nurse her and then we'll make lunch for the kids. And I also got a package, I gotta put that in the fridge, um, a package from Fashion Nova. So I'm excited to show you guys that too. 
Okay, so I have a cup of butter and a cup of sugar in here and I'm going to mix it. Make sure this is locked. Yep, it's locked. So you wanna beat that together until it's smooth and then we add the vanilla and the egg. So I just put in the vanilla and the um, egg and then I'm gonna whip that up too. in here and we're just gonna slowly add it to the wet stuff in here like a little at a time and then mix it there's snowman And we're gonna do reindeer. Yeah, so you wanna do that one. Okay, so push it down, good girl. You gotta do it a little bit harder. So you push it down like this, watch. But I made it. You did, and then you look, you go like this. You shake it. We gotta do it a little bit closer to the edge. And then, mm -hmm. look it. You did that! Now we put it on the cookie tray. You want to do another one? Yeah. Okay, just wait for Mama. <laughs> oh, we have to put this back together. Hold on, Mommy's not ready. Do you want to do a snowman or a Christmas tree now? Um, snowman. Snowman. Wait, wait, Mommy's not ready. Okay, do it close to the edge. No, 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 no. Like, like down here. Okay, now push down. No, 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 honey, you push down. Push down. No, sweetheart, like this. You know, ready? And then you go like this. You hold on to it and you shake and then look. Snowman! We'll put that on the tray. Wanna do more? How about a Christmas tree now, okay? Okay. Okay, so put it right here. Yep, and push down. Push down. Good girl. And then shake it. Hold it and shake. Look it! You did it! Look at your little tree! Good job! We'll put that one on the cookie tree too. Then you just put them in the oven for six to eight minutes, um, and then we can decorate them later. So I'll make the icing when they're napping. Oh, okay. <laughs> and I'm gonna make lunch for them now. Okay guys, I got the baby and Olivia to bed. I'm wearing a different shirt. This is one of my new tops from Fashion Nova, and I love it. You can't probably see the back, but it's all like twisted. There it is, twist back. Super cute, super comfortable, I love it. Um, I am so exhausted, I have lipstick on because I just finished my second half of my reel that I did for Instagram. I'm literally just going to empty the dishwasher, reload it, just clean up, and then make pizza dough and sit down and do nothing because I am so exhausted. <laughs> So I thought while I'm waiting for my timer to go off, because I have to let the yeast to sit in the warm water for um, five minutes. So while I wait, I'm gonna have this bad boy and another coffee. And then once the pizza dough is made, I'm gonna sit for an hour um, and just watch Selling Sunset because I never, like since, well since Blake actually start stopped napping, this time last year, I don't do nothing when the other two kids nap. So I haven't like sat down and done nothing in the day when the kids nap in like over a year. It's just cause usually I'm working, usually I'm filming or I'm editing or I'm uh, you know, working on, that's such a good angle. Or I'm working on a, something with my Instagram or one of my businesses. Um, so it'll be just nice to just like, sit and do nothing and watch Selling Sunset. It's only an hour, but I will take it. And then when the kids get home, we'll make up the icing, because it doesn't take long to make the icing. We'll make up the colors, and then um, we can get pizza going. Um, so yeah, I'm really tired. It seems like a lot of people are having a hard day today. Today is Friday, um, December 3rd, is it? Second, third? Third, third, um, and a lot of people seem to be having like a hard day today. There goes the timer, and I'm not sure why, but I'm I'm having not like a hard day, but like for example, the guy that bought the stove 
called us and was like, ah, I turned it on, it started smoking. Literally never happened. So Colin said it, something could have loosened on the way over or maybe like when he was driving it in his truck or maybe, um, excuse me, maybe um, it was just like on its last leg and like it just decided to go once we moved it. I don't know. Anyways, we gave him his money back, obviously. Um, so Colin's gonna pick up the stove. Um, so that was like a first little bummer. And then um, we've just had to make, I'm not gonna get into it and I'm not gonna accept any rude comments about it because I am not about that. I very much do whatever makes you happy. You guys know that, um, no judgment either way. So I appreciate the same. Um, I'm not gonna get into it, but we just had to make a difficult decision about this Christmas, um, you know, with COVID and numbers going up um, and stuff like that and this new, variant just great like i'm telling you guys this is not going to end for another couple of years and it sucks and whether you're on the side of it's all a conspiracy and don't get vaccinated you believe that good for you girlfriend you believe that till you're blue in the face that's awesome <laughs> um if you got vaccinated good for you girl you know what i mean like do you but we've had to make some difficult decisions on what we believe in and what makes us happy and comfortable for this time of year and no matter what side you're on it's just shitty to not see some family members for whatever reason it's just shitty but um it is what it is and you know what there could be a lot worse things that we have to decide. Uh, we all have our health. We all have a roof over our head. You know, our, our children are safe. You really, can, you gotta put things into perspective whenever you're having a hard day because there's so many worse things that could happen. Um, and not that your feelings are not valid because they are, but it just helps to kind of be grateful. Just stop when you're having a hard day and just like, you know what? I'm grateful that I even have family that I can still spend time with. Or I am grateful that we have a roof over our head and we have our health and we live in a beautiful country or whatever it may be. We still have to think that to put things into perspective. Anyways, that's all I'm going to say about that. I'm a little bit bummed. But I'm going to turn this around and I'm going to finish the pizza dough and then I'm going to sit my ass down and watch some Sun Sunset. This is how my day's going. I'm fighting with the saran wrap. So I sat down for a good 10 minutes before the girls woke up. She slept an hour and Olivia slept, well, 12.30 to 2.30, so two hours. Um, I am like barely hanging on. We gotta go get Blake now. So now we are gonna add our food coloring to our icing. So girls, oh no, no, just one, honey, just one, just one. So this is what we do. We take a Q-tip. This is called Kelly Green. Kelly Green. Kelly Green, and you take a toothpick. I to do it. And you just kinda, it's like a gel. So see, it's a gel. Then you add it, and then what we're gonna do, see how little mommy did? Then we're gonna mix it. So I'm gonna, and we're gonna, you know what, this needs, this needs a little bit more milk. It's a little too hard. That's my milk. Yeah, and they're for us too. I cut too big of a hole in the bag. Oh, that one's done, honey, not that one, not that one. Okay. Yours looks beautiful, and maybe yours too. That's as far as we got, and now I have to do supper. Oh my God, I broke a couple cookies, but it is what it is. So I gotta preheat the oven. Um, oh my god, I didn't even do the chicken and the bacon yet. Ooh! I'm so, I do, I give myself way too much. Honestly. So, this is our pizza dough. Look at my kitchen. <laughs> like, I used the same recipe I always used. I used a scale to do it perfectly, like to measure perfectly, and it just, it's so gooby, I can't do anything with it. Reese was crying. I don't have time to, okay. I don't have time to make more dough, so I told Colin to order pizza, because I just can't. I'm just, I'm done. Daddy saved store. the day with pizza, didn't he? You're out the zone. <laughs>